What's up, you guys? Hey, everyone. Woo! Are you excited to go to Costco? Heck or? yeah, baby. Gonna go get some samples. Man, I got an excited husband. Yeah. I guess it's just because school's back in. There are so many parking spots here. It's blowing our minds. Anyway, so yeah, that was nice. We have to walk like a mile into the store. Oh my goodness, do we have an exciting day ahead of us. So as many of you guys know, we've been teasing. I'm sorry about that, but it's been kind of fun. We've been giving you little carrots. We like the teasing, it's fun. Of three big surprises that are happening, and one is happening today, you guys. Woo! But we have so much we gotta do in preparation for that. We gotta go to Costco. We gotta get all the stuff. We have to take it back home. We have to unload it all. We have to put it all together. We have to get dressed. We have to get showered. Yes, we have a lot to get done. So this video will just be Costco. And by the title of it, I know you guys love Costco. So you were here for that. But make sure you come back tomorrow because the first surprise will be revealed. But the reason we are here is because of that surprise. We need to get some things. Ooh. And you'll see why. We need to stock up. And you guys, I'm so excited to see what Costco has today because it's back to school. So that means they probably have a ton of really good snacks, which we are in desperate need of. And then we want to load up onto some of our face. Okay guys, we are here in Costco right now. And one of the things that we definitely do not need on our Costco <laughs> list, but Brittany just found, is things. this. No, but we do need this, not necessarily at Costco. Yeah, we do need something just but like we this. We've been looking look far and wide for something like this. We went to Ikea, came up empty handed, but this is like almost primo of what we're looking oh for. Oh my gosh, I wanted something in our bedroom to yeah. go across from our bed, and I love this. This is really cute. Let me step back so you guys can see. Yeah, that looks really good. It looks really good. Plenty of storage. Plenty. This online? I like think Costco so. Delivers? I think we probably should. Yeah, Costco delivers. I, no way I want to haul this back home. You watched our video yesterday. You saw we were debating we need more light in our family yes. as well. And a ton of you guys said we should get another floor lamp. Yes. So thank you that. I don't see any I love here, but they do yeah, they have some great options. I actually really do like this one. I think hey, it's this cool. Would, this actually looks a lot like our light fixtures in our house in Utah. Yeah, the this would be perfect. Do you remember? Literally perfect. It would match there a lot. Speaking of our house in Utah, you guys, we actually had our friends reach out to us. They were able to install a new sink for us, which we are so stoked about. It looks beautiful. If you've been watching our videos, we kind of have a plant debacle going on. <laughs> Look at this Oh thing. my gosh. This is perfect. This is literally what we want. This is literally what we want. We really should pick that up. I say we get it. Wait a second, hold on. Mother-in-law's tongue was $10. This is $149. Okay, but it's huge and it lasts forever. You still want it now. Yeah, and I feel like it'll look so good in that corner. <laughs> let me see, let me see. This is a, it's quite a bit of money for a, a fake one. We will get this based on your guys' comments. How do you like that? <laughs> so far we've made a couple aisles and we haven't found anything yet that we are actually on our food list. Related. Yeah, food related but on I our really list. Like seeing other stuff Costco <laughs> has too, right? Speaking of which, check out these Tommy Bahama chairs. These are probably cooler than the ones we have and I would have to say and they are cheaper by a long yeah, shot. This is awesome, you guys. We live in Florida. We go to the beach all the time. We use our beach chairs all the time. So if you do too, like I would definitely come that they're great prices. See, Britt, now we're getting to the good stuff. We don't have a kayak yet. We have paddle boards, but we don't have a kayak yet. No, you guys, <laughs> no. You guys know we literally have four paddle boards. I know. It takes up so much space in our apartment. <laughs> we have three bikes, four or five scooters. It's getting bad to the point that I think we're either gonna sell them or we might be doing a giveaway of some sort. I don't know. Yeah, we'll have to figure it out. We use them when we have visitors, which we have visitors all the time. Yes, coming. nonstop. It's just taking over our apartment like yeah. I have no space for it. We're having to get really creative with the space we have. Okay I'm just looking at something really quick. Oh, Jared, we don't have we definitely have room for this though. Hey who <laughs> loves slip and slides? I remember growing up it was like my favorite thing was slip and slides. She, she literally just said we don't have any more room and then no, said we need to get I'm this. Back in Utah at our house. Oh you know, yeah that, that would be dope. Now. Slip and slide and into a pool. If you are in the market for a slip and slide kids. Into a pool? Sure or just on the ground. <laughs> So as you guys know, we like to get stuff for the people who may or may not be coming. One other person, I just saw it's peach cheese in here and southern peaches. I'm so excited, you guys. Living in Florida now, we get to experience a lot of the delicious produce. So the person coming loves peaches. There's one little tip. Okay, you guys know we love our pre-made meals. I'm gonna see if they have any new ones. One of our favorite is definitely mm -hmm. the Taco Kid. We're definitely picking up one of those. Ooh, this looks like a new one. 
This is a chill season St. Louis oh, ribs. Yes, please. Oh my gosh. We've tried their meatloaf and mashed potatoes. Mindy actually introduced us to this. So good. I think we're gonna grab one of those. This one looks new, enchilada baked with rotisserie chicken. And then the lasagna, that's new. We've had their chicken salad, that's really good. I feel like you can't go wrong with their chicken alfredo. One thing I love here in Florida is they have so many types of shrimp. So this is a shrimp salad, shrimp ceviche, and then they even have a cilantro line shrimp, and then just shrimp cocktail. Here, okay, this one's new, roasted chicken sandwich. Ooh, that looks really good. That does look really good. We may need to pick up one of those. That's a good deal, only 10 bucks. Is it? Two big pieces and a salad. That's awesome. We also have the yakisoba stir fry noodles. That's one of our favorites as well. This is new cilantro lime crema everything mm -hmm. sauce. Have you guys tried this? I wonder, that looks is delicious. This the same sauce that's in their tacos, maybe? Maybe. Oh my gosh. If it, it is, we be. need to just down that. I think we need to get one of these. Another staple we love is their basil pesto. I always just toss this in with some noodles, some mozzarella, tomato, make such a good quick easy dinner. All right, you guys, I just want to get Brittany's reaction to this real quick. Hey, Britt, tell me what you think about this. <laughs> no. Only in Florida will you see this. This is a new find. These are baked scallop potatoes. Okay, my mom makes the most incredible ones. So I'm actually really curious to see how these are. If you guys don't know what scallop potatoes are, they're just cheesy, cheesy potatoes. These actually look pretty good. Gotta get the spinach artichoke parmesan dip, you guys. I actually usually like the one with jalapeno, but I don't see that one today. If so. you guys haven't had this, get it. It's oh, really, really good. So, so good with their pita chips. Fried pickle. Oh my gosh. And ranch dip. This has your name written literally all over it. You guys, I would be doing <laughs> us all a disservice if I don't get this and try it. I will get it and you try it. Just Google it. happiness and this is what's going to look like. You guys know how much I love pickles. Oh my gosh. I'm so excited to try this. You guys, I definitely feel like they have all the school lunch supplies out and ready to available. They got like Capri Sun, Sunny D's. All the back to school snacks, which is so fun to see. Speaking of that, Jared just found some samples. Oh, what else did you find? Oh no. Check this out. We are definitely getting these. Oh my gosh, you guys, the waffles with the like caramel inside. Mm. I haven't tried this kind. Yeah. Dang, I'm already. So happy. <laughs> I'm happy with my pickle dip. Jared's happy with his waffles. We're out of staples like paper towels, toilet paper, water. So stocking up on all that good stuff because Costco has the best prices. I only got invited because you want me to push the cart. <laughs> Why else does he come? <laughs> hey, he gets samples. A lot of the time I'm like, where did Jared go? Look over by the samples. Seriously, there that's how is. I found this. This wasn't even the sample, it was just something else that's next to it. You guys know I'm a sucker for these though. These are my absolute favorite. <laughs> they are. So I have a question for you, babe. Yes. Growing up, did you pack school lunches or did you eat lunch at school? Probably my mom packed them. Yeah? I ate more school lunch, mm. I would say, and the older oh, I got. The chocolate milk they had to like push out. Yeah, and the Tampico yeah. and all that. But then as I got older, I Definitely started making my Tampico. own <laughs> I started making my own lunches. Any of you guys, are you more make your lunch or school lunch? And what do you do for your kids? Also, I feel like any of you guys going back to school, one of our favorite things are their bagels. You get two packs for a great price. So I picked up some everything and some cinnamon. Also, you guys know we love rotisserie chickens and I don't know what it is about Costco's rotisserie chickens, but they are incredible. So definitely picked up one of those. I wanna get you guys' opinion real quick. So these are like super top rated over on Amazon and they're clearly like got a huge showcase right here. I used to give you Finn like the dose where he can chew it. But this one's like a squirter. I've never done anything like that before. Ooh, yeah. You let, guys us, let know. us know. You've never done anything like this before. We've got to the frozen section. And I feel like Costco always has really good frozen meals and options. So I want to see if I can see anything Acai new. Bites. What is it? Look at this. Acai bites. Acai bites? Oh, wow. We always do the acai mix for bowls that's really good. But I wonder, you just eat them? It's I wonder crazy. if this is anything like that true food. Oh, maybe. Oh, true fruit. Oh my gosh. Anyone try the bacon and Gouda egg sandwiches? I feel like that would make an awesome quick grab and go breakfast. These are one of our all time favorites and someone that's coming loves these as well. So definitely pick them in the back of these. To go with our dips, you guys, Stacy's is the only way to go. If you know, you know. I hear her mom's got it going on. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was so late. I just grabbed a gallon of milk. Um, when did Costco change their 
changing. Look how crazy this milk is. This is really is. weird. It's like flat like this. This is like a cylinder I milk. I've been out of the loop on the milk thing here, but. This is like a liter of milk. I feel like it'll kind of liter fit in shape. the fridge better. It's like yeah. thinner. I don't know. I actually didn't like it. It looks really weird, but Let I do like know. it better. Is this new? Ooh, you guys, this is something that I have not seen. It looks like it's a deep dish style crust pizza. Oh my goodness. Have you guys tried this? Talking about nostalgia, one of my favorite things growing up was bagel bites. Still love them to this day. If these were the pepperoni ones, I would definitely get them. So, so good. Also, the little pizza bites. I feel like those are a classic after school snack as well. So I hear there's a little debate whether Costco's orange chicken is better or Trader Joe's. If you guys haven't tried each one, I'm curious. What are your thoughts on that? This looks really good. Shrimp wonton ramen. That looks delicious. We love their little mini wontons. I still have some of those, but those are some of our favorites. Well, I just found Jared. I went to grab something and it looks like he found the spot. He missed out on a good sample. What was it? Oh, no. Little smoothies. Ooh, little smoothies. Jared's been getting all the samples. So glad they're back. Tomorrow is actually a very special occasion. You will find out about it here coming up, but we need to pick up some flowers for it. You could say Costco has the best selection of flowers. Their roses are always on point. Like how many beautiful colors they have in right now. Like anything you can think of, I feel like they have it. Which color should we get this I one? don't know. That one is kind of pretty. Yeah, I really like the pink. They also have really pretty just bouquets that they put together as well. And their prices are just awesome. We made it to the snack section, you guys. Like this is the ultimate back wool stock up section as well. Everything you could ever want or need, they have here for sure. Babe, have you tried the brownie brittle before? I have not. It is very good. <laughs> so you guys, one of our favorite snacks are Sun Chips, the variety pack. We're gonna pick up one of those for sure. We always debate whether to get a classic mix or the fun flavor mix. Jared's Jer the fun flavor mix. Jared's the Lame. fun flavor mix. Big surprise I've there. Burritos, guys. And I'm That's the classic it. mix. Yeah. <laughs> oh boy. You think we were going back to school? We've been filming a lot recently <laughs> in here, like on our phone for Instagram. So if you guys aren't following us, definitely go over there. And oh, check guys, out. I got some good like ideas. Here, just gonna be making fun of oh, me. I got some good ideas. Hey, this is something I haven't seen before peanut brittle bites. Ooh, if you're a peanut fan, I bet that's really good. You guys, he's putting back the fun flavor mix. We're going for protein trips. They're okay, they don't taste as good as that. They it's also way better for you. Someone else coming to our house, you guys love, love, love these. So definitely picking up a bag of these. One of our staples is the Korean beef jerky. So, so good. This is a new one though. These are mini beef sticks. It looks like they have quite a bit of protein, zero sugar. So mm -hmm. you usually get the Tillamook ones that are similar to this, but these are like individually packed. And you guys know our favorite place is Taco Craft. That little Korean short rib I get, it's almost identical to this. I feel like this would be a great snack to sit through on lunch bags too. Pack to the gills and it's time for us to head on back because we have to get all the stuff into our car, then back home, load it up. We did not bring the wagon. Oh my gosh, we're done for. Oh my gosh, we didn't bring the wagon. We then, will go get it. Yeah. That is what I call one successful mm -hmm. It's been a minute, but if you guys have any of these favorites you've seen, please let us know down below because we would love, love, love to try them. You guys, it is a warm one here in Florida. My goodness. It is hot. It is hot. We have a pretty empty trunk for the most part. Jared did an awesome job. We found some boxes. It's interesting. They've really gotten rid of like people checking you out and they moved to more just self checkout for the most part. We went to someone that helped us because we had so much stuff, but look at that packing yeah. job, babe. Good packing job. That is primo. And then just our big items here, but awesome haul, babe. And that was what, about an hour, I would say? T minus an hour, that's pretty quick. Well, you guys, you're gonna get gas, but the line is oh out my of control. God. All lanes of the Costco gas are completely filled and it goes around the corner, oh. onto the freeway frontage road. Oh my gosh, back. you guys. Wow. Look oh at my that. Gosh. Oh my gosh, I can't even see the end. Yeah, that's bad. That's probably what? Over an hour wait at There's least. There's no way we're waiting to get gas. Oh my goodness. Bad. Look, Look I can't it just goes. 
It just goes and goes and goes. This that is almost is, like a driving hazard. I that's can't crazy. see like, what's behind Yeah, that is kind of tricky. And we're back, baby! Yeah! We're back home, you guys. <laughs> we got all the groceries. She didn't even mention this. Look at that. Look at oh. that. Well, get up I totally forgot. <laughs> yes, you guys. Jared is in his airport get up. There's yeah. One more hint for you guys. Woo. We're going to go ahead and close out today's video because we got to go pick up some very special people. Yes. From the airport, you guys, make sure you come back tomorrow. We have so many fun things planned <laughs> and in store for you. Some big surprises coming up. They're gonna be huge, guys. Absolutely massive. If you guys are not subscribed, hit that subscribe button right now. Come back. We have some huge, huge surprises coming. You guys, we hope you enjoyed our Costco haul today, and we'll see you all tomorrow. See you guys. Love you. Bye. Bye.